homegrown freshness. That's what you get when you buy locally from your farmers. You know, our produce is excellent here in our state, and if you're looking for quality, you want to buy local. And you need to look for those in places like the UPIC farms, the farmers markets, or even your local grocery stores. And if you check in your grocery stores and you don't see something locally grown that you know you have in your area, ask the manager. Ask them to bring it in so that you can have Mississippi locally grown produce available for your family meals because it truly is the freshest. And there's so many varieties to choose from. We've got 43 different varieties of vegetables and fruits that we grow here. So you want to be sure to use those all throughout the year for your family meals. This is a simple recipe. It's using roasted vegetables with some quinoa. So we start with our vegetables. This is squash zucchini squash as well as the yellow squash, some carrots and red onions. Now all you do is chop them the size that you want, take about a tablespoon of olive oil, just stir it all around in there good so that it's coated, pop them in a moderately hot oven and then you just let them roast for about 20 minutes. This is a great way to do vegetables and to have them readily available for many things. I like to do this, uh, I use it in things like vegetable for my spaghetti, for instance, sometimes to add extra nutrition and things in there, and sometimes I sneak it into my meatloaf as well. It's really tasty that way. We're going to start with our quinoa that we have here, and to this we're going to add our roasted vegetables. And it's going to add beautiful flavor to this. You can see it. Just so very pretty. And again, it's a simple dish to do. We're just going to sprinkle on a little bit of sea salt. And we're going to top it off with some fresh squeezed lemon juice. This is going to make for a delicious side salad that you can have or a side dish to go with your favorite meat product that you have at your family meal. So you can check us out at our website at growingmississippi.org and find this recipe and a whole lot more for using our fresh produce here in the state and search for us on Facebook by finding Farm Families in Mississippi. Oh, this is just going to be great for a family meal. We invite you to learn more about Mississippi agriculture and its importance to your daily life. Visit growingmississippi.org.